All right, good morning, fam. It's day two, and I'm gonna start this vlog off where yesterday's vlog ended off. Let's go get supplies. Supplies? Some supplies to finish up this photography stuff so I can do some uh, photo work for getting some new products up. Let's get into it. So I actually feel really good this morning. I obviously feel much less bloated, but I've got really good energy about me, so I'm stoked for today. Skip. Let's try this again. See if I can get this damn stuff and get this going. Okay, so since I couldn't find any tracing paper, parchment paper will have to do. Okay, so while I was at the dollar store, I figured I would buy myself a new sketchbook because it's been a long time since I've had another sketch pad for physically drawing with these fingies. The main thing that I was on search for, parchment paper. So that is going to be used to drape over the front of these lights for some diffusion. Because when lighting a subject, diffusion is one of our best friends. To help get that nice soft light and to get rid of some of those hard shadows. I'm doing product photography, so I'm able to do long exposure, i.e. leave the, the shutter open for a long period of time, so I don't need large amounts of light. So these little lamps is gonna be enough. Okay, so in order to get this together, I'm gonna basically lay down some new poster board in the background here, because this one's gotten all grody, and I gotta get some parchment paper over these lights because as you can tell, this light is rather harsh on my face. Um, and if you can't tell what I mean. So the easiest way to think about this is that the diffusion is gonna act essentially like how clouds act in front of the sun. Whereas if you're staring at the sun direct on with no cloud cover, it's really harsh, really hard on your eyes. Whereas when the sun bounces through the cloud itself, it diffuses the light, makes it a lot softer, get nicer shadows, better colors, and everything of that nature because it's not so harsh. So the light coming off of this is rather harsh right now, and if I take this parchment paper, place it over the front, it's much more appealing and much softer. I like it. Of course, the one fault with damn wax paper is no tape sticks to it. So I gotta find a way to get this to stick to the lamps. I'm thinking maybe paper clips or something. <laughs> damn it. Okay, so I couldn't figure out how to get this attached, so I put a couple staples in there, so I got a little pocket. Now it just slides right on. Fresh white backdrop down now. This is great for that seamless white. Hell yeah. What's up? Classic. Come home. Cats are always in boxes. Okay. Motivation. Every day I see these things. So motivating. Okay, since I've started working on some pre-production for the Alpha Tryon record, my solo project, I need to start practicing. So let's get some practice in.
Well, that was sloppy as all hell. But it feels so good to have the fingers moving again. Ooh. I definitely got a lot more practicing to do before it comes time for actual tracking, let alone scratch tracks, but that's why I'm getting her going. That's why I'm getting her started. You gotta start somewhere. And I'm apparently back at almost square one, so. up a Black Label Society fan and you'll <laughs> So many squeals. There's probably a large percentage of you that don't even know that I played music for pretty much the vast majority of my life, so Finally getting my album underway this year and getting warmed up getting started again so I can get these scratch tracks and stuff going So I can get the full pre-production underway so I can analyze everything keep it a little little spicy spice But I'm gonna end the vlog here because the rest of the day is pretty much gonna be me drinking green juice and editing the vlog Not very exciting. Although I wish I'd hang out with you guys I'll see y'all tomorrow <laughs> So I'll see you guys in tomorrow's vlog and as always Find your passion, create dreams, and let's get it!